To make a rubber band heat engine, you can use the bearing from an old hard drive, a 12 inch brass ring, and some rubber bands. You can take the bearings out of the old hard drive and preferably find a hard drive that has two discs on it, because this makes construction a little bit easier. You can loop a rubber band around the ring and then slide it in between the two discs. You can then use Velcro to attach the bearing to a simple stand made out of 2x4s. The initial rotation that you see in this video is actually caused by the ring not being well balanced. You can add mass to the outside of the ring to balance it before applying heat. Rubber bands contract when heated. This causes the center of mass of the ring to shift over to the left a bit. This in turn gives you a counterclockwise rotation. This engine will stop from time to time as it takes some time for the rubber bands to heat up on one side and cool down on the other. Some of the delay has been edited out of this video as it can take up to a minute for one ring rotation for engines that are not well balanced. You don't get a lot of useful work out of this kind of engine, but it does demonstrate how you can take a fraction of the heat generated by a source and convert it into useful work.